Governor Sirica Dixon wants the $1 billion planned to be withdrawn from the excess crude account for national security to be spent on all regions with challenges, including Bayelsa State. Paul Dixon also demands that 13% be deducted from the money and sent to all producing states. TVC News, Ovie Temi George has the story. Governor Siriake Dixon told journalists that while Bayelsa State is not opposed to the withdrawal of the funds to enhance national security, regions plagued by similar challenges should not be left out. And we have no objections to us procuring equipment uh, to enable them to do the work that will safeguard our country and secure uh, the lives and properties of Nigerians. Um, everywhere in the country, Bayelsa therefore inclusive. So we are interested in how much of this fund, uh, when eventually disbursed for purchases, uh, will actually aid the work that the security agencies are doing in the Niger Delta and in Bayelsa. Just as we are concerned about uh, the challenges in the Northeast, this security investment uh, should be general in nature and should go to support the equipment of our military and security services across board, across board, not just uh, in one particular area of the country. The Bayelsa governor said he had discussed the issue with the chairman of the Economic Council, Vice President Professor Yemi Oshibajo, and also the chairman of the Governor's Forum. The 13% derivation has a rationale, which is why you have it there in the Constitution, because the Constitution, all of us realize that those states like Bayelsa that are producing oil, we also have our own peculiar challenges, environmental, as well as even security. You know, we deal with community and we, we support the work that the security agencies are doing. So um, our position, therefore, is that eventually this money is to be given. Uh, then firstly, the derivation, 13% derivation component has to be worked out. Otherwise, the Niger Delta states, including Bayelsa, uh, would have contributed twice. So now I've taken these concerns, I've shared them with the, His Excellency the Vice President, who is Chairman of the National Economic Council. I've also shared these concerns with uh, the Chairman of the Nigerian Governors Forum. Ovietime George, TVC News, Yenagoa, Bayelsa State.